Now then, boozies, right? Got a special guest today. Uh, Andy, he's gonna, uh, he's coming aboard. He's gonna uh, make his first brew. That's yeah. Thanks very much for the uh, yeah. warm welcome, Chris. No worries. It's just a shame Mark's not here. It is. It is a shame, but he wants his video sending over, so yeah. we'll do that. And he's going to help us drink the bottles of beer as well. Oh, certainly will. Yeah. So we're going to start off with the stout, and we're going to do also do a Canadian blonde. So that's how, that's what we're making today. So while we've sterilised the buckets, sterilised our uh, utensils and whatnot, so it's now it's just a case of filling the water, put some lukewarm water, probably go about, say, to about five litres of just lukewarm uh, water, warm water. Brilliant. Right. I'm going to fill. Oh, so you're trying to avoid like bits of lamb scale and stuff, yeah. yeah. Your hot base. So why are we doing this, right? Why are we putting so much heat in there? Because we're putting the sugar in. We want a sort of like a glucose, do you know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, that's what you want. So with the hot water, you go up to only five litres with the hot. You can go just under or just above. I, I not sometimes just go above the nozzle, mate. Right. Yeah. Just sort of got enough to put that in so I can give it a good stir. All right, okay, yeah. Yeah. Yo, I'm going to video you doing this. Yep, yeah, okay. Right. Uh, so you're going to put one one, uh, one kilogram of hand salt sugar, right? You can get hot, you can get brewing sugar, right? You can buy it. A couple of quid. You best not get one of these, man. They're cheap. They're this is the cheapest way to do things, you know what I mean? You want to make home brewing cheap, right? So, there we go. We'll drop that straight in there. Right. So that's one kilogram of sugar. And then now, with the sterilised spoon, now you're going to give that a good, good turn around in there. And you're going to make that nice glucose, sugary liquid. Because yeast, as you know, loves, loves sugar. Happy with that. Okay. Now for this, this will be liquidised now. Right. I recommend good old fashioned can opener these modern ones are shite yeah they're shite luckily I've got one of them brilliant right we're now we're going to open up our tin so we're just doing a normal kitten kilo standard homebrew and the smell off this I wish you can smell this, but Andy's going to have a niff now and he'll tell me how exactly that for me. It's a smell of home, but right there. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that is beautiful. Beautiful, that. Isn't that fantastic, that? Oh, that's lovely. Magic in a can. That is lovely. We that, so just we'll grab ourselves a little tea towel. And now what we're going to do, we're going to drop this brew into here. And you just move, you just move that spoon for his hand, cheers, pal. And then we're going to stick that straight in there. See how it's liquidised much better. Yeah, loosened everything up. Yeah, it has. Just makes makes life easy. We'll put that back in there. We want every little bit of this. Right. 
every little bit of that. Oh yeah, that smell is unbelievable. It is good, that, yeah. Get your spoon again, just give that a little bit of a turnover. And wait for the hot water again. So while Andy's doing that, just gonna have a little a little drink on my bro. Why not? Oh that is unbelievable. Oh I love that smell. Reminds me when you walk past Cameron's brewery. Yeah, exactly. Get every last drop of goodness out of there, yeah. eh? Frothy. Okay. Stir this until it's... Frothy. Right. Doesn't matter what way you go, just keep staring. And now this is the most important bit when you when you actually don't brew in these big factories, you, you get the machines done, you can just picture yourself these big massive barrels, you know what I mean? Where it stairs, doesn't it? Yeah. And that's same process. Same but, thing, yeah. just on a smaller scale. Yeah, yeah. You know when the brew in here is ready. When it's all put together. Smell like. Beautiful. Right. Where's that temperature? Is it coming down yet or not? Is it anywhere? It's still off the mark. It's still off the scale. 